Is this Roblox? Might as well be right now. Just trying our best to gain some credits. So it looks like they went for the DLC economy instead of the other economy. Alright, two more. Now let's charge. There we go. Still don't have the fast jump charge ready, but that's fine. Should be able to take these guys out, no issue. One dead. Two dead. Then we get to do this. More of them are coming in. Bilbo! It's time for you to annihilate, brother. Go on. Gotta cancel. My shields are just not holding, so. No, save the cargo. Oh, for fuck's sake. Alright, well done, boys. Good old man of action. Let me go home, please. I'm just trying to go home. These guys don't want me to. This is taking a longer break from War Thunder. I've been doing too well and I'm just going to play some other stuff. Makes sense. Like, at the end of the day, that's what should be done, right? So this fast jump charge, we can really only use, like, one submission. So we should really prioritize when we use it. The cooldown for it is insane. Come on. Alright, let's go. Back to mother, mother base. There we go. Another successful mission. Well, that gets us a little bit of coin. Gonna need a lot of coin, actually. Unless we get a bonus from killing somebody. I feel like there's an upgrade like the Pigeon and Bomber Crew, because he was glorious, especially the Mark III with his pilot cap. Oh, there probably is gonna be. We'll see. Inspirational speech? What? What is inspirational speech? Spies the crew, recharging some abilities and restoring their health. <laughs> okay, it's pretty useful. We're just gonna have to go. Oh wait, no, we can afford one, can't we? Right. We'll give Bilbo the first one because he's our better one, and then we'll just do this one. Wait, how much do we need? Weapons, 2,900, so we need 1,500. Perfecto. All right, let's go test our new toy. Bilbo's on it. Um, no. There we go. So you have like an Inspire? What's this? So we can, we can literally heal and make our guys do better with an inspirational speech from the captain. So Yuki, it's all in your control now. <laughs> oh god, that's so funny. Yeah, Bilbo with the missiles, and then we just need to switch Wolf's weapon for now. We'll see how this inspirational speech works. It might be quite comical. Alright, defense. Oh, level 9 you get something. Then we have overdrive. Oh wait, I need to put you in position. 
Overdrive, backup power, no energy, weapon active. Okay. Alright, let's see what happens with these missiles. When we're able to use them. That's four. Here we go. <clears throat> let's see. Oh! I thought they were homing. What's that shit? What? They can just dodge them anyway. You gotta be shitting me. What is this? What's that? What are you doing? Oh, it's terrible. Oh, Jesus. Oh, well, there you go. You hit one. Hopefully this does more damage than the other thingy. Let's see. Oh. I thought they would just... I don't know, man. They're just not doing fuck all. Like, I suppose they're kind of homing, so maybe, it, maybe this will be better against certain things. Yeah, it seems to be better against things running away. We should have check, checked the damage that they do. That's very, very depressing. Just focus fire everything. Go crazy. I mean, it looks kind of cool, but uh, it seems like we have the same issue. Don't hit fuck. I need, like, an actual laser weapon, you know? That's what I need. Like, inspirational speech. We can do this! <laughs> right. Wonderful, Yuki. Words straight out of my mouth. Alright, let's see. So the fire rate is definitely hurting the missiles, but we do they do seem to do more damage, so how are these missing though? Oh my god. This is terrible. How is this ever gonna hit like anything small? Like all these weapons are designed to hit big belugas. I don't understand how how it's gonna work, but uh, we'll see. There we go. They seem to hit stuff from range. Maybe that's what we need to do. All right. Well, whatever happens, we are using them. So. Yeah, homing missiles. They say. Yeah. I feel like I've been jibbed by the manufacturer here. Many of them weren't homing. What's this game about? Basically, the way this game works is it's a survival game where you control the whole crew and you also control all of the upgrades to the machine. Think about if you took something like FTL and then you had more creative control. Alright, the Space of Mark 1 does survive another trip. Or we just get ourselves a little bit of coin. A little bit of XP. Alright, let's let's actually have a look at the stats of these. So the plasma. Okay, so it does more damage than the minigun. Slightly. Like 20 more. So we are gonna go for it, but it's still rough, you know. We have five credits. Okay. Hopefully we don't die now. That would be bad. Um Do we just go for it? Recover comms probe? What do you think? Do we do it? I think I'm gonna go get this done. We have all of our things that we need. All 
Alright, full shields. Wolf, it's time to go. We can always turn around if shit hits the fan. Should be fine. Right, so I think this is the main mission thing. Lost the probe at the edge of the solar system. Okay. So it looks like we're gonna go find that probe. Let's see what happens. May contain important data, gonna recover its data bank. I don't like this word may. If I'm gonna risk, like, the crew, you know, if I'm gonna risk the, the life of all of my people, I want something better than may. I would like a, it does. Thank you. So there's enemies inbound. <clears throat> we can deal with them though. Weapon effectiveness is 115%. We're gonna go the safest route, definitely. No, missiles away. Let's see what we can do. Let's play defense. We don't need to... We're just going to make sure not to lose anything here. Hopefully... Ooh, nice hits. Yeah, so that's what we're looking for right there. <laughs> we have two invaders coming in. <clears throat> so I should give Otto a bit of focus fire. Let's see what he can do. Nice. There we go. Can we take him out? Come on, we gotta take him out. Yeah, yeah. there we go. Alright, we're doing okay here. Like they're, they're, they're not doing enough damage to me, so we can just kind of sit here and tank as long as we want to. The missiles do seem to be hitting every once in a while, which seems to be okay. We're just in that state once again where we're not doing a ton of damage. Alright, shield's gone on this guy. It's gonna come in there. Alright, Bulba, uh, Bilbo. Once again, it's time for you to go and say hello. Nice. Bilbo, you gotta hit them, brother. Alright, go heal this up. And extinguish. And once again, like, I don't mind them sitting around me. Like, that just means it's easier to kill them. Because they do literally no damage to me, so... I wish this was here. That would be a much better use of my time. Now, there's one dude left, let's just charge. We're ready to go. Bilbo's taking names. Well done. Oh, it's one of those pods. Yeah, we'll be fine. Alright, good start. Took literally no damage. Let's just kill this guy. Come on, man. <laughs> right, next point. Let's go. How's no one dead yet? Skilled command. Also helps a lot that i played this game before. Well, sorry, i played Bomber Crew before. So I know what to look out for and all of that good stuff. And also, like, a game like this, the, um... The way to do it is just to not take any risks. Because the moment you take risks... Like, there, there'll be some risks you have to take. But a lot of it is more like... If you, if you decide to take risks that will completely, um, you know, just decimate you. It's obviously not a good idea. Right, let's cancel again. That would be a risk right there. We're never gonna make it, so... Might as well just take a chill pill, go into D, and see what we can do. Oh. Oh. Okay, 
That's quite a lot of damage there. No, I'm not killing anything. Right, performance. What broke? How did that break? Come on, get there. Yeah. Okay. I'm not sure if we've killed anything yet. Everything looks very much alive. Maybe if we use a bit of focus. So, Otto on the focus. Let's put, like, uh, Bilbo on the focus, too. Maybe that'll make our missiles be a little bit more accurate. One down. Oh, Otto. Just do a bit of evasiveness. No, Yuki, you goddamn fool. Uh, plan B. Losing the situation. Right, hands go to stealth mode. What the hell's EMP? Right, Wolf. Uh, you need to go here. Otto, you need to heal yourself. Repair this. We seem to be doing even less damage now with the missiles. Which I'm incredibly surprised by. Right, there we go. Let's get everybody back to their stations. Okay. There we go. Alright, this is perfect missile range. Let's see if you can do anything. Oh god, dude. Just hit something, would ya? Like they're taking chunks off me. <laughs> right, they're literally stood still. Right, well done, you hit one. What? What are you firing at? One died, finally. There isn't long range in this game. That's not how the game works. I just need somebody to hit something. I keep even diverting more power to the weapon so I don't do anything. There we go. I have to get- I have to wait for them to come like this close to kill them. And even then, look. Oh, help me, god. Alright, let's see. 
This should finally deal with them. Oh, no. We're turning again. Right, there are two left. Three left. Can we just can we just shoot them, please? Can we just take them out? Because I have nothing to do right now. Apart from just watch this guy. Yeah, there we go. Let's go let Wolf heal. I think this was the second quadrant. I think there's like three or four more. So this is going to be rough. It's going to take us a while to do this. And mainly because our guns are just not exactly in the greatest shape. So, Like we're not taking that much damage or any damage. It's just literally the... Oh, Garat is back. That calls for fighter support. Right, missiles are going... Oh, wait, hold up. Right, missiles did a decent bit. He literally just dodged them though. Right, his shields are down. Can we fire, maybe? Can we do something? Maybe? Could we hit him? You know? Maybe. Oh, there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh. Oh. God damn it. Well done, Wolf. Okay, go back. Oh my god, man. What is going on here? Big fuckers. It's okay, right. We targeted them. Right, what's fucked? Let me get your spacesuit on, Wolf. Right, to the engine. Oh, there's a fire. Well, that's a worry. We'll deal with that later. This is not the time to retreat and refuel, please. Come on, Wolf. Get the engine up. Let's go. Alright, let's get him back inside. Right. Let's do stealth mode. Oh, we killed Garat! I didn't even realize, but Garat is down, so there we go. The menace is finally dead. Now we just have to make sure everything is okay. There's more enemies coming up, but they don't know we're here. Rice. Is everything okay? Yeah, I mean, our, our ship is still completely fine <laughs> at this point. Like, I, I don't know what else to say. Like, we're... Oh, well, apart from it keeps breaking. But apart from that, it's doing fine. Should probably go on the attack. See if that helps. Like, Wolf is being able to repair everything as we go. Hans needs to get back in here. So the miss. Oh. Let's do a bit of evasive flying while we get everybody back in position. <coughs> yep, we killed Garat. We must have missiled him randomly when he was doing his flicks. It seems like the reason you buy these missiles is to kill Garat. Because they can't, they can't kill anything else, as you can see. So we'll see how it goes. Let's go back to your objective. See if we can deal with some of these guys. I mean, the thing to do would be this, right? Let's just do a nice cheeky EMP. Boom! There we go. So you can just slow down time, take some of them out. 
For some reason they weren't doing that before, but it's nice to see they're doing it now. So we just got to use that EMP to be able to do that. That's fine. Oh, Otto is about to get absolutely shit canned. Oh, they died. All right, get back on. Oh. Wolf, please. Oh, we're gonna have to evasively fly again. This wolf isn't repairing this quickly enough, and our shields are fucked. Alright, we need the spacesuit. There we go. Oh, the back's fucked again. <laughs> Looks like we're gonna get set on fire again. That's okay though. Like we're keeping everything together. Everything is still everything is still green on the machine. Otto is also green, but that's because of radiation, so that's a bit of a worry. There we go, engine back up. There's only like two of them left. Ooh, that was a good hit. Come on, get the extinguisher. There we go. In goes Wolf to save the day once again. Alright, one guy left. Nice. Alright, let's just, let's just make sure... The machine is all healed up. Right, now we jump. So we're going to the Quipper Belt, the Homia, or however you say it. And Otto is healing. We have to come all the way back here as well. Right, so we have to kill everybody first. At least that's what it's saying. Our shields are back online. There we go. 